This video will help you learn how to turn improper fractions into mixed numbers and vice versa. For example, sometimes your answer will be an improper fraction such as 7 over 4. This is called an improper fraction because your numerator 7 is larger than your denominator 4. To turn this into a mixed number, you have to divide just like the fraction bar says. Boys and girls, a fraction bar is just another word for division. So here we have 7 divided by 4. 4 goes in, into 7 one time. 1 times 4 is 4. Subtract and you get 3 left over. So we have 1 remainder 3. And this whole thing right here can be your mixed number. We have 1 whole. Remainder 3 is what's left over over your original denominator of 4. So we have 1 and 3 fourths is the same thing as 7 fourths. These are equivalent fractions. However, on a test, I prefer seeing this because that is simplified. Thank you for viewing my video on how to turn improper fractions to mixed numbers. Before we leave, we also need to learn how to turn mixed numbers into improper fractions. So let's give the improper or the mixed number of two and one half. Well, sometimes you need to turn this into an improper fraction in order to subtract with renaming. To do that, it's very simple. This is one, two. This is the same thing as two and a half. Here I have two and a half circles completely filled in. But if you notice, I have one, two, three, four, five pieces shaded in with a denominator of two because they're each divided into two equal pieces. Well, to get that using math, all you do is take two times two and then add your numerator. Two times two is four plus one is five over your original denominator of two. So again, in order to turn a mixed number like 2 and 1 half into an improper fraction, take 2 times 2 plus 1 and you get 5 and keep your denominator of 2. Thank you for watching my videos.